Good morning. We're definitely seeing some foggy conditions as we take a live look outside. It's a little bit worse the farther inland you go right along SPID. Visibility is not too bad at this time. Now we've had a pretty mild winter here in South Texas. Not the case out west where we're seeing one big snowstorm after another. You can see them trying to clear those mountain passes in the Sierra Nevadas. They're having to uh, put those chains on, travel very very difficult and as this one winds down yep there's another one coming in behind it we're looking at 68 degrees right now with mostly calm winds relative humidity is at 93 percent most of the temperatures upper 60s a little bit warmer in kingsville 71 degrees 64 in orange grove beeville coming in at 61 you can see visibilities orange grove is at zero the same for alice also over in hebronville ingleside and poor day the visibility is at one mile. We do have a uh, dense uh, fog advisory. It has shifted a little bit down to the south as we are seeing the wind start to pick up out of the north and that's going to be pushing that fog out of here and increasing our visibilities. Will be a little bit breezier today with the winds blowing at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Here's a look at the combination radar and satellite imagery. You can see quite a bit of cloud cover. We've got a front that's coming through this morning and as that pushes that moisture out Hopefully we'll see a little bit more sunshine than we saw yesterday. Still looking for temperatures in the mid 70s, but it will start to cool down as we head into the evening. Any rain we do see, it looks like it's going to be very light. Then it should uh, hopefully again start to clear out this afternoon. Moisture is going to start to come back for your President's Day and maybe even some rain as we head into Monday night. Looking at the rainfall totals, it's going to be very, very light. Just some drizzle, less than a tenth of an inch of rain. But here's where that cooler air is centered, 20s and 30s, and it's going to be slowly coming closer to us as we move throughout the day. Here's the uh, real part of this storm system. We're not getting much rain, but they are seeing the rain across parts of the Tennessee Valley, a freezing rain across parts of Kentucky, and here it's mostly snow. And here's the next one coming in from the west more heavy rain and mountain snow also temperatures are definitely cool but not any real frigid air out there single digits for most of the northern tier states while most of the southeast remains pretty pleasant here's a look at our forecast for today fog and drizzle afternoon clearing look for a high right around 75 degrees tonight we'll see a little cooler temperatures will drop down to about 50 degrees winds out of the northeast 10 to 15 miles per hour seven day forecast brought to you by NEC Co-op Energy. So for President's Day, about 65 degrees, some sunshine, but then with increasing moisture, we'll see a chance of showers Monday night. Looks like it's going to be a damp middle part of the week. Some reinforcing cooler air. So daytime highs, upper 50s to lower 60s. Then we're going to dry out and warm up as we get closer to next weekend. We have a lot more coming up on Sunrise. Stay with us.